So without any further ado, I'm going to bring up our opening remarks uh, speakers. We have Darren Bennett, who is the Chief Information Security Officer from the City of San Diego, and Joe Oregon, who is the CISO from the San Diego Law Enforcement Communication Center. Coordination Center. I told you I lost my notes. Um, so please welcome them. Thank you and welcome to San Diego. Um, my name is Darren Bennett. I'm the CISO for the city here. Um, before I get started, I just want to I want to thank um, Sherilyn and the folks at Elevate Gov for hosting or putting on this event here. Thank you very much. It's a lot of effort. coming and making the trek down to San Diego. You folks from uh, LA area, I know it, it probably is a little bit of a trek, though I, Orange County. I think the, the trek part is probably, hopefully there wasn't much traffic down here. It would be local to your areas. And for those of you out of state, I'm sure it was a real strain to have to come to San Diego. Um, <laughs> um, I'm here with Joe Oregon. Joe and I are great partners and I recommend that all of you in your local areas, if you're not good partners with your local LECC, you need to be. Um, that relationship is, is very important. Um, it's important that you have it in advance in case you have issues. But um, you know, when, when things go sideways, this is one of the first people I contact. And the LECC, they really help coordinate things. They help bring everyone together and they help herd the cats when the, um, what, what's the term you use? When defecation hits the oscillator? There it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, Joe, what do, you, what do you got in your bag there, so, first of all? So I just wanted to shout out to the vendors. <laughs> yes, the good guys and I was talking, but they have swag. So there's toys and, and all kinds of neat stuff that I can lay on my daughters, right? So I'm, I'm taking it home to my daughter, but I'm going to play with it first. But there's swag, right? So That's like a little helicopter, right? Yeah, a little helicopter deal. And a yo-yo, yo, which I, don't, I shouldn't do this in front of the camera. <laughs> so right, we just officially turned it into a DEF CON kind of event, right? So, um, but I'd like to say um, thank you all for attending. Um, very privileged to be here and, and, and speak in front of you all. Um, San Diego has a long history of collaboration, working together in a close community here. Our IT and security communities um, really, uh, really go out of their way to share information here in the city of San Diego. We have several uh, different type of workshops, whether they're CISO roundtables uh, with like 100 plus CISOs um, from our organizations within the Southern California, San Diego area, or our local CCOE, Cyber Center of Excellence, um, our local InfraGuard uh, fusion centers as well. We all kind of um, work together to create this information sharing environment, very similar to what Elevate Gov is doing today and trying to get us at least to start talking to each other, start collaborating um, across uh, cross collaboration, kind of scratch each other's brain cells when when we need to start building those relationships. Scra scratch each other's brain cells. Brain cells. Well, I only have one, so <laughs> I like it. All right. Now, that's that's one thing that I think we're most proud of about here in San Diego, and I know some of you have this, but I also know that it's a struggle sometimes. And that's we're a big city with a small town feel, right? Well, I think the same is true in our cyber community here. We have an awful lot of technology companies probably not compared to the San Francisco or Bay Area, but we have an awful lot of tech companies here in San Diego, um, a lot of security, and we're very tight-knit. And you know, I think events like this are one way that help get us out of our own local community, but, but again, that, you know, that's everything. You know, the bad guys, he said collaboration and information sharing, those are the key. And we get to do both at events like this, um, at the CISO Roundtable, and you know, our adversaries, you guys have heard this a million times, who here thinks they're good at sharing their information with each other? Only a couple of you? They're very good at it. Um, they hold it close to chest sometimes, but they're very good at it, and we need to be as good. Um, you're going to get the opportunity to hear some people today, later, especially um, one that I'm really looking forward to. I have my team here, some of them, and they're going to go, and that's Deborah's talk. Um, we saw a preview yesterday, and it's excellent. Um, and that's a really good, it, she kind of, she holds no, she doesn't hold anything back. She tells you all the truth. Here's what happened. Here's what went right. Here's what went wrong. And it's you know invaluable. Um. So just as we take a look at networking and sharing your knowledge um, before we take off, we just want to make sure that you take advantage. You take advantage of the, the time to kind of communicate, get out to know each other, um, make the contacts, etc. Um, it's important, especially as I mentioned earlier, when things get a little hairy. You like to have those uh, contacts well in advance. Um, you have a bunch of great guys and gals from um, a lot of different 
um, sectors, whether it's critical infrastructure, private, public, law enforcement. Um, definitely try to reach out to your partners here while you're here at this event. So I just want to say thank you all very much for coming. And Darren, do you have anything else before? Enjoy the city yep. and uh, enjoy the conference. Thank you very all much. Right, thank you, ladies and gentlemen.